The brand new Stay PG Holiday merch is finally here! And you want to go ahead and get your hands on it super fast because once it sells out, it's gone forever! Head over to StayPG.shop today! In today's Roblox Adopt Me video, we are taking a look at realistic Adopt Me videos! That is right, videos that show us what Adopt Me would look like in real life! I almost had to stop watching because I was so shocked! But before we get into it, do not forget to hit that like button, subscribe button, and use code MEGANPLAYS when purchasing Robux. Hey, what is up, you guys? It's Megan. Welcome back to my channel, Peachy Squad. Today, I'm so excited because you guys absolutely loved the last Realistic Adopt Me video that I reacted to. So today, I thought I would react to another one. Guys, also, do not forget to check out my real life channel at Megan. I'm going to start posting more over there. I am trying to participate in Vlogmas, so look for a few Christmas-related vlogs over there starting very, very soon. So our first video is by Rosewater, linked down below. Let's get into it. This video has 5 million views, by the way, so you've probably already seen it, but I have not. I don't even know if I need headphones. I guess I'd rather be safe than sorry. Giraffe. Oh my gosh. So we all love the giraffe pet and adopt me. We know exactly what it looks like. Of course, I have a neon giraffe named Sparks, which I'm excited about. And that's the giraffe in real life. Have you guys ever seen a giraffe's tongue in real life? It's actually really long and it's purple. Did you know that? Did you also know that when giraffes fight, they fight with their necks? They hit their necks together? to fight for women and dominance. A frost dragon in real life would look like, you know, we see the regular one, but the real one would look like this. Now, can you imagine how scary something like this would be? Like it would probably have like frost breath and freeze you and freeze things around you. Look at these little soldiers here. I don't think that they're having a very good time. I know I wouldn't. As soon as it dips below uh, 80 degrees, I'm already cold. I mean, I am from Texas native, so. Yeah, not for me. A griffin in real life. I cannot wait to see this. So we all know what the Adopt Me griffin looks like. It's a legendary pet, but I think it's the least appreciated one. And that's in real life. It looks like a big bald eagle with bigger wings, a tail, and some talons. Next up is Bat Dragon. Bat Dragons honestly scare me. I think that they have scary faces, and I'm not a fan. Ah, no! I don't like it. I don't like it. It's just like a real life bat. Like, it's a bat that's like really big, and it's got really big wings. It kind of reminds me of a gargoyle. Like, you guys know what I'm talking about? Like a gargoyle, like on top of a church or on top of like a city building. What? Are, what's the point of gargoyles? Comment down below if you know, because I, I don't know. So scary. Next, next, next. Golden egg. Okay, let's see what it looks like in real life. We, I mean, it's a golden egg. I think that's a little bit self-explanatory. <gasps> that's so cool. They found one with like scales and everything. I wonder if that's like a phoenix egg. A frog. Okay, so we have the regular adopt me frog. Very cute. And then we have a real life frog. <laughs> That's so cute. Normally frogs don't look that cute. That one was a really cute one. So unicorns, which are definitely real, by the way, we have Honey the Unicorn, my very best friend, most legendary pet in the game, if you ask me. And there's a real life unicorn, guys. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. It's like a horse, but cuter. Real life owl. So we have the regular owl in Adopt Me, you know, soon they're creating a new winter owl, but look at this real life owl. Ooh, scary. I think this is my third video in a row expressing how much I think owls are scary. So parrot, adopt me, and then a real life parrot. Guys, they're so bright and colorful. Can you believe that anything is this bright and colorful in nature? It's absolutely beautiful. Now I think that animals have real bright colors in nature to let predators know like I might be toxic, don't try to eat me. <laughs> That's kind of like why I dye my hair pink. It's so predators and people just naturally avoid me. Still super cute. Arctic reindeer. Now I think I saw this one in the last video that we did, which is linked somewhere above if you guys wanna see it. They're literally so cute. One of my favorite pets in the game and oh my goodness. I adore that. A starfish in real life. Of course a starfish in real life would look like Patrick from SpongeBob SquarePants, duh. But probably not. More realistically, it literally just looks like a little star. Ooh, a flamingo. I see flamingos all the time whenever I go to the zoo. So we have the one in Adami, which we know is super cute. And then in real life, they're a little bit more scary, but I mean, they're pink birds and they're massive. So next up we have a meerkat. We have the Adopt Me meerkat. Lil Nas X said that this was his favorite pet in the game. Can you believe that? <laughs> Real life. Oh my goodness. It reminds me of the Lion King. So we have the Dodo. So this is the Adopt Me Dodo. By the way, we've switched over to a Sunset Safari video. She's linked down below as well. So we have the regular Dodo and then we're gonna check out the real life Dodo, which you know, all these pets are now extinct. Ew, I don't like it. <laughs> They're kind of cute. 
Those are honestly like a little scary. They're not as cute. They definitely cuted them up for Adopt Me, but Adopt Me is a really cute game. So that makes a lot of sense. Oh, and there's some photos. Uh, I, I don't really like it. <laughs> a Dinocus. A Dinocus? A Dinocus. Dinocus. A Dinocus. There it is. So this one I just called the blue dinosaur because that's kind of hard to say. What is that? Oh my goodness, guys. Can you believe that's what those look like? A Diplosaurus. Diplosaurus. Super cute. So we have the green ultra rare dinosaur pet now, which I love. I think I want to do one of these videos when the winter pets come out. What do you guys think? Oh, <laughs> dinosaurs are so scary. They're so scary. <laughs> I don't like them. I don't like them. I don't like them. They're so scary. I'm scared. I think that this video was just a little too much for me. Ground sloth. Now it's like Sid the sloth. I hope that she shows an ice age photo. They were big. How big were they? <gasps> 22 feet! 22 feet? Seriously? You're telling me they were 22 feet big? No, no! Oh, that was a lot. What's next? The Glyptodon. Now, I was curious at what one of these looked like in real life. So in real life, oh! I've seen one of these. They had one, some of these in Ice Age too, I remember. See, Ice Age! See, I told you! <laughs> That's a picture from Ice Age. Glyptodons lived at the same time as early humans and interacted with them. 11 feet long! Oh my gosh, I'm so glad dinosaurs aren't real anymore. <laughs> a pterodactyl. Now these bad boys are scary. Ooh, can you imagine one of these swooping down and grabbing you? How big are these? I was always under the impression that they were really small because in, um, in that one movie, Land Before, time Petrie he was a tiny little guy but these are actually looking kind of big 40 feet <clears throat> okay okay I feel like not even overreacting well I am overreacting but I'm not hamming it up 40 feet oh that's terrifying you know what my wingspan is probably like five feet five five and five foot seven feet almost six feet it's bigger then maybe two rooms put together. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. 11 and a half feet tall? No. How scared would you be? That's so scary. I guess I'm glad that they're so cute and adopt me. Sabertooth, now these are also an Ice Age. I'm convinced that the entire fossil egg was inspired by Ice Age. <laughs> we looked up all the dinosaurs at Ice Age and all the animals at Ice Age and they were like, that's what we're doing. Scary, but yes. Oh my goodness. That's really cool though. I mean, they're, they're cute. I like the stegosauruses. Stegosauruses are some of my favorite dinosaurs. I just think that they're really cool. Fantasia had some stegosauruses in them. They have these spines on them, which make them hard to bite. And then they have a tail with spikes on them that they would use to defend with. See, look at that tail. That would hurt to be hit by. You would die. How big are these? How big are T-Rexes? They're kind of cute though. I like them. T-Rex, oh my gosh, I'm not excited to hear how big T-Rexes are. You guys know I'm scared of dinosaurs. <laughs> I'm scared of dinosaurs, scared of owls, scared of most birds. Oh my gosh, literally so scary. That's massive. The dinosaurs, the specifically T-Rex, can bite at 3.6 tons. A ton is 2,000 pounds. We can buy it at 200 pounds though. It's pretty cool. So scary. They're so big. But good thing Adopt Me made them super cute. A Tasmanian tiger. Now these are cute. I think. I hope. I think that they're cute. I mean, in Adopt Me, they're cute. And in real life, look at them. They're so cute and tiny. Is that it? Oh, that, that's it. That's cool, but that's kind of scary though. Honestly, I don't like them. They're scary. <laughs> They're cute, but why do I live my life in such fear? I shouldn't have watched this. I thought I was gonna like have like, you know, a really cute fun day, but now I'm just like getting scared. Like I'm scared guys. I like Triceratops too, because Sarah the Triceratops from Land Before Time was my favorite character in Land Before Time. So that's a cute one. Three meters tall. That's not as big as some of the other dinosaurs. I mean, it's still pretty big. If I came across one, I, might, I would cry. Woolly mammoth. Oh my goodness. Also, these are kind of scary too, but this is another Ice Age character. Look at them, they're so cute. They were covered in thick fur that could be dark or light and it insulated them from the cold, which we love. They died out 10,000 years ago. Rest in peace to the woolly mammoths. Rest in peace, Manny the Mammoth. 
from Ice Age. Guys, I hope that you enjoyed today's real life Adopt Me video. I know I definitely enjoyed watching these, even though I thought it was really scary. Do not forget, Overlook Bay just had their brand new winter update, so it is gonna be linked down below. I am going to be playing it all weekend and even giving away some free pets to you guys over on that game. So check out Overlook Bay right now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Do not forget to always hashtag stay peachy, stay kind, and I will talk to you guys next time, guys. Bye!